You think Phoebe Vincent has been making clay earrings her entire life. She's a pro. They're beautiful. Thank you. Vincent is the creator behind Cotton and Clay Co. Her logo tattooed on her arm. Today you can buy her handmade earrings at local Charlotte stores like Girl Tribe and online. But I'll warn you, once they go live, they're snatched up within 10 minutes. So I originally started back March of 2017 when I had my son. Um, I was making macrame baby teethers because I wanted to provide like a healthy alternative to the plastic. And I started selling it to local moms in Charlotte and it took off and I realized how much fun clay was to work with. So I started doing the clay earrings and showing them to other local moms who bought my teethers. They're like, you should really sell these, you should really sell these. Vincent's earrings are bold and fearless like her. I actually have a degree in criminal justice. Oh, wow. um, <laughs> I know. <laughs> I don't use it, clearly. <laughs> I was still in school when I had my son, like right before I started my business. And when I had him, I realized I want to be home with him and I want to be able to raise him and be a part of his growing up. So kind of just put my degree on the back burner. I know I'll use it one day. For now, Vincent uses her creative juices on dazzling and unique pieces. She showed me how it's all done. Ooh, this is fun. It's very therapeutic. Conditioning the clay and rolling it was just the first step. It's like making cookies. It really is. <laughs> Vincent then bakes the clay and voila. This is like my favorite part, putting them together. Yeah. Add some gold hooks and you've made a masterpiece. There we go. You did good, <laughs> shoot. Now it was time for me to try them on. Oh yeah, they're super light. They are. And that's funny because those are like what I would consider my heavier earrings, but they're still really light. Yeah, extremely light. And they kind of, and the you movement. know, the movement. Yes. In all seriousness, Vincent says she wouldn't have been able to get this far without other women business owners in Charlotte who've inspired her and took a chance on her product. Moxie Mercantile was the first one. I always say like, I owe a lot to them. And then Girl Tribe was next and I became good friends with Sarah and she's been a huge help to me with business stuff and just kind of pushing me to do the uncomfortable, which has been awesome. Beautiful designs. Vincent says it is so important to her to support stay-at-home moms that since she launched her business, she's hired two full-time women and she hopes to grow in the years going forward. This week, Channel 9 is speaking to other local entrepreneurs, too, to learn about their incredible work and success. And we will be live at the Girl Tribe pop-up event for a special Your 704 Live on Saturday. You can watch it here on Channel 9 at 1230.